Hey, what's up, YouTube? So, I'm at Spartan Hospital, Animal Hospital. I'm about to get a couple of my females ultrasound to see what's going on. Um, hopefully, some females have eggs. Hopefully, some of you females have follicles that are nice size to let me make sure I'm putting males in with them. Um, so, I'll let you guys know what happens and all the details. All right, peace out. All right, here's one of my big girls' follicles, so she's most likely grab it right now. And I'll give you updates on everybody else. Yeah. All right, YouTube. And so I'm back from the vet from getting ultrasounds on um, some of my girls. I'm gonna go through and let you know what. I found out and everything on this girl she is close to ovulating or already ovulated I might have missed it but her follicles are 1.14 uh, and 1.14 centimeters and it's already starting to I think you say calcify or it's starting to show little things inside her follicles on the ultrasound thing. That's just, it was showing something growing inside. So she's either about to ovulate or she already ovulated. So she'll be doing a pre-lay shed in uh, probably a week or so. So probably get eggs from her in like a month and a half. Um, This girl right here who is in with my inchy male... She, her follicles are really small. She's going slow this year, so she might go real late this year. Her follicles are only at 0 0.4, 0 0.6 centimeters. So, not really that big. So, I'm going to keep putting males to her. Mostly the inches going to be put to her just to try to pull inches out and see if I can prove out his pattern. I really would like to prove out his pattern. So, that's the plan with him. Um, my Mojave girl, let me get some more light in here, my Mojave girl, her follicles were at 0.3.4, so another one's starting to develop follicles, she might go later in the year, she's been bred by the albino, I might throw the pastel wama in there a couple times, but mostly the albino is going to be in there because I want some het albino Mojave's. Um, here's my other normal girl. This is the one that has been laying inverted and everything. Her follicles are like 1.15. So she's ovulated or is close to ovulation. She also has like things starting to grow into her follicles that showed on the ultrasound so she should be laying eggs in a month and a half or so so get a clutch out of her he couldn't tell me like how many on her or how many on the other girl but it looked like it was like maybe six for her and five to four for that other girl down there and my last girl uh, is this big normal she also her follicles were at uh, 1.3 1.5 centimeters so she's likely grab it so she'll be laying in a month and a half or so and she's been paired with the pastel wama, the spider, um, the calico, the inchy. So most likely, I think the it's either between the pastel wama and the spider, because the inchy got in there kind of late with her. I think she had already, you know, ovulated by the time the inchy really started locking with her and everything, but. That's what happened with my trip to 
the vet for ultrasound and so now I know where my girls are and I feel a little more better about my season so it looks like I should expect eggs if everybody keeps going on the process they're going and I still have two other girls that might go also go this year I'm gonna show them in another video so that's gonna be a surprise one is it gonna be a surprise the other one you already know but uh, thanks for watching YouTube comment subscribe um, let me know if you sub me and I haven't subbed you. I'll sub you no. I'll sub you no problem. Just let me know. I get busy sometimes and I forget. I try to keep track of my new subs and make sure I sub them and watch your videos and whatnot. Oh, uh, until next time, YouTube. Hope everybody's season's going good. Um, loving to seeing the eggs pop up and um, seeing the feeding videos and. The, first clutch videos is awesome um so until next time youtube peace out